A Quantum Sounds production. Is Quantum Sounds production. Quantum Sounds production. And the Lord said unto Cain, Word is Abel, thou brother. And he said, I know not, am I my brother's keeper? That's what you need, to tell God every time you see a man in sin and don't tell him to repent. Am I my brother's keeper? Hell yeah, you your brother's keeper. You're supposed to make sure your brother's don't go off. You're supposed to make sure your brother's keeping the law, statutes, and commandments. I guarantee the brothers beside me, if I have me, will make sure if I go off, they're going to tell me according to what the God says. That's what Penny comes back to God. I'm going to show you what the true problems of the Lord is going to do according to Christ. Who are the true followers of Christ? We are. And we are here to tell you Negroes to keep God's commands. But what, but what mentality do you have? And the Lord said unto Cain, Where is Abel, thy brother? And he said, I know not. Am I my brother's keeper? So you Negroes love saying, you just do you, Bama, do me. Don't tell, you can't judge me. You know what that means? I want to stay in my sin. You can't judge me. I'm telling you women, you're here looking like whores and sluts. But you say, don't judge me. I'm covered in the blood of Jesus. I'm covered in the blood of Jesus. You can say what you want to say. Come up here and ask a question if you're so damn smart. Because your leaders haven't taught you nothing. You don't know nothing. But we're teaching you something. Nah. Luke 14, chapter 22. And the servant said, Lord, it is done as thou hast commanded, and yet there is a room. And the Lord said unto the servant, Go out into the highway. Go out to the highway. Go out to the highway. This is a highway. It may be a ragged highway, but we ain't to tell our people that we're being to keep God's commands. We ain't to tell you and do what Christ said. To go into the highways and tell their people to repent and keep God's commandments. And the Lord said unto the servant, Go out into the highways and hedges and compel them to come in. He compel you to come in and keep God's commandments, or you will be destroyed. That's right. Give me Luke 19 17. I'm going to show you that what you're doing, you hate your brother. When you see another black man, you don't see Christ, you see your enemy. And I was talking to you by your enemy to hate each other, to rape, rob, and murder each other, to kill each other. When that's a commandment of God, not to kill, not to steal, but you will kill a brother just because he has something nice. The brother worked hard to get what he got, but you'll continue to steal. Kill that brother for what he has. And our young women out here lost, looking like grown women, looking like whores and sluts. Not queens and princesses of the most high God. But it's high time that you wake up out of sleep because when Christ comes, it ain't no excuses. You ain't gonna smile, coon your way into heaven. He gonna get your damn head chopped off when Christ comes. If you don't repent and keep God's commandments. Yeah. Leviticus chapter 19, verse 17. Thou shalt not hate thy brother. You hear what God said? You shall not hate your brother or your sister. In thy heart thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor. And that's what we're doing right now. We're rebuking the hell out of you wicked Negroes and telling you to keep God's commandments and repent or you will be destroyed. And it's not a joke. You're seeing the disasters on this earth right now. You see what's going on with these tornadoes. You think that's just Mother Nature? No! That's the Lord God of Israel showing you that it's high time to wake up out of sleep. That's right. For your salvation is still, but you expect it. It's high time that our women stop dressing like whores. 
Our men stop being effeminate and man the hell up. You have kids, you take care of them. You have kids, you take care of them. You take care. Don't give it a woman just because she look good and she got kids. Man up and be the man of that household. And keep God's commandments. You get a job, you work. Pull your damn pants up. Stop going to jail and be the man that the most I wanted you to be. Is Israel 